This portion of the CU Podcast is brought to you by ThinkGeek, whose love of Legend of Zelda has spawned some of their newest products. The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild Traveler Shield Backpack and the Sheikah Slate Sketchbook. Support the podcast and check them out at thepunkeffect.com slash thinkgeek. The uh, Nintendo Switch has a limited edition coming out for limited edition. Uh, Monster Hunter Double X. Uh, hopefully that'll come here. Monster Hunter X did for the 3DS as uh, Generations, I believe. Um, Monster Hunter is obviously huge in Japan. It's got a pretty good following here. Um, it kind of ran with uh, initially the Fantasy Star Online style of gameplay and then took it uh, way deeper, way crazier. Um, but what I would want to touch on, I think, a bit more here is that the Monster Hunter Special Edition is interesting. Um, comes in a nice box and all that. Um, and it has a really cool Monster Hunter uh, Switch dock. Um, and then it has a... Uh, detailing around the edge of the tablet, um, the the actual center tablet piece, to make it uh, look very Monster Hunter themed. But because the Switch is so modular, what's interesting about this is, I imagine we will probably see a shitload of um, Switch Special Editions. All you oh, gotta yeah. do is make a new dock. Yeah, well, All you got to do is add a, a silk screen to the edges of your tablet portion, and boom, you've got a new special edition. Change the color. You're not printing an entirely new um, case like you would for a 360 or an Xbox One. These are very, very minor adjustments. I mean, you could take your existing Switch docks, silk screen some new art on them, and, and done. Well, I predicted, obviously, I predicted with the Joy-Cons. That's a no-brainer. We've already seen different colors coming out. Splatoon colors are coming Splatoon out. Splatoon colors, neon yeah. yellow colors for yeah. arms. I mean, yeah, you've got everything. No, but I don't think a lot of people said, okay, what well, about the docks? Because when, we, when you look at the actual Switch tablet, there's not a whole lot of space, space to work with on the side. Maybe on the back, you can do something. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, so, and that's yeah. the other thing I forgot. There's the back. So you still screen the back. You still screen the top and bottom, which they showed. And you, you make a new dock. And it, it, it to me, it just seems a whole lot easier than making special editions for anything else. So it'll be interesting to see. Uh, we're not going to get this one, correct? It's only going to be in Japan. Oh, well, we may. They just haven't announced it yet. Okay. But I doubt it. But uh, a, a Nintendo, an Odyssey one for Christmas, Super Mario Odyssey. Why not? You know, if they wanted to, or a Zelda one. Uh, absolutely, you'll, you'll see a Zelda one. I almost guarantee you'll see a Zelda one at some point with like a gold fucking Triforce on both sure. sides, and it'll and they'll sell out instantly. You know what I mean? Like it is it, Nintendo. They know how to get the money out of you without it seeming like they're gouging you. Right. You know what I mean? Like they're they're not going to charge you a huge amount more for it. They'll just bundle it with the game. And so they know that, okay, it's an extra incentive. It doesn't cost us really anything extra to put a Triforce on a dock, but we can, we'll can we sell a lot more. We know that. And you'll, and, you'll, and you'll buy it, even without a premium price, just throwing in, you know, throwing in a freaking Zelda, I don't know, napkin or something in with your game. I don't, I don't <laughs> fucking know. I'm thinking of Alicia Larry. Alicia Larry, 30th anniversary. Yeah. We can talk about that later, but whatever. Uh, but we're going to see that. We're going to see the Joy-Cons. I mean, hell, I'm looking at the, the Splatoon uh, Pro Controller they announced. It looks gorgeous. Yeah, it and it's the same thing. You, you, they change the colors on the wings, and they have the etching of, of Splatoon stuff in the middle. Mm -hmm. It's like, you'd, get, you'd go out and buy that in a second. Yeah, I would. Um, so, <clears throat> Nintendo's in a good spot now uh, with their hardware. I wonder if, if this is going to be sort of the new collector's market for... Because they never really took off with like all the different Wii variants or... There wasn't was enough Wii U variants out there for people to care, but I wonder. No. But I wonder if you'll end up having like someone like 30, 30 docks, uh, switch docks in the future. Probably. You know I mean? Nintendo's just gonna you know laugh all the way to the bank with that. 